Day 451 Tuesday, June 25th, Hosea 1-3, Hosea 1, 1 11 NKJV The word of the Lord that came to Hosea the son of Beri, in the days of Isaiah, Jotham, Ahaz, and Hezekiah, kings of Judah, and in the days of Jeroboam the son of Josh, king of Israel, when the Lord began to speak by Hosea, the Lord said to Hosea, Go, take yourself a wife of harlotry and children of harlotry for the land has committed great harlotry by departing from the Lord. Dot. So he went and took Gomer the daughter of Diblaim, and she conceived and bore him a son. Then the Lord said to him, Call his name Jezreel, for in a little while I will avenge the bloodshed of Jezreel on the house of Jehu, and bring an end to the kingdom of the house of Israel. It shall come to pass in that day that I will break the bow of Israel in the valley of Jezreel. Dot. And she conceived again and bore a daughter. Then God said to him, Call her name Loruhamah for I will no longer have mercy on the house of Israel, but I will utterly take them away. Yet I will have mercy on the house of Judah, will save them by the Lord their God, and will not save them by bow, nor by sword or battle, by horses or horsemen. Now when she had weaned lo she conceived and bore a son. Then God said, Call his name lo for you are not my people, and I will not be your God. Dot. At the number of the children of Israel shall be as the sand of the sea, which cannot be measured or numbered. And it shall come to pass in the place where it was said to them, You are not my people, there it shall be said to them, You are sons of the living God. Then the children of Judah and the children of Israel shall be gathered together, and appoint for themselves one head, and they shall come up out of the land, for great will be the day of Jezreel. Hosea 2, 123 NKJV Say to your brethren, my people, and to your sisters, mercy is shown, bring charges against your mother, bring charges, for she is not my wife nor am I her husband. Let her put away her harlotries from her sight, and her adulteries from between her breasts, lest I strip her naked and expose her, as in the day she was born, and make her like a wilderness, and set her like a dry land, and slay her with thirst. I will not have mercy on her children, for they are the children of harlotry, for their mother has played the harlot. She who conceived them has behaved shamefully, for she said, I will go after my lovers, who give me my bread and my water, my wool and my linen my oil and my drink. Therefore, behold, I will hedge up your way with thorns, and wall her in, so that she cannot find her paths. She will chase her lovers, but not overtake them. Yes, she will seek them, but not find them. Then she will say, I will go and return to my first husband, for then it was better for me than now, for she did not know that I gave her grain, new wine, and oil, and multiplied her silver and gold, which they prepared for Baal. Therefore I will return and take away my grain in its time and my new wine in its season, and will take back my wool and my linen, given to cover her nakedness. Now I will uncover her lewdness in the sight of her lovers, and no one shall deliver her from my hand. I will also cause all her mirth to cease, her feast days, her new moons, her sabbaths, all her appointed feasts, and I will destroy her vines and her fig trees, of which she has said, These are my wages that my lovers have given me, so I will make them a forest and the beasts of the field shall eat them. I will punish her for the days of the balls to which she burned incense. She decked herself with her earrings and jewelry, and went after her lovers. But me she forgot, says the Lord. Therefore, behold, I will allure her, will bring her into the wilderness, and speak comfort to her. I will give her her vineyards from there, and the valley of Acre as a door of hope. She shall sing there, as in the days of her youth, as in the day when she came up from the land of Egypt. And it shall be, in that day, says the Lord, that you will call me my husband, and no longer call me my master, for I will take from her mouth the names of the Baals, and they shall be remembered by their name no more. In that day I will make a covenant for them with the beasts of the field, with the birds of the air, and with the creeping things of the ground. Bow and sword of battle I will shatter from the earth, to make them lie, down safely. I will betroth you to me forever. Yes, I will betroth you to me in righteousness and justice, in loving kindness and mercy. I will betroth you to me in faithfulness, and you shall know the Lord. It shall come to pass in that day that I will answer, says the Lord. I will answer the heavens, and they shall answer the earth. The earth shall answer with grain, with new wine, and with oil. They shall answer Jezreel. Then I will sow her for myself in the earth, and I will have mercy on her who had not obtained mercy. Then I will say to those who were not my people, You are my people and they shall say, You are my God. Hosea 3 1 5 NKJV Then the Lord said to me, Go again, love a woman who is loved by a lover and is committing adultery, just like the love of the Lord for the children of Israel, 
who looked to other gods and loved the raisin cakes of the pagans, so I bought her for myself for fifteen shekels of silver, and one and one half homers of barley, and I said to her, You shall stay with me many days, you shall not play the harlot, nor shall you have a man, so, too, will I be toward you. Dot, for the children of Israel shall abide many days without king or prince, without sacrifice or sacred pillar, without ephod or teraphim. Afterward the children of Israel shall return and seek the Lord their God and David their king. They shall fear the Lord and his goodness in the latter days. Daily Deep Dive The UCG reading plan states, The prophet Hosea was contemporary with Amos, both having preached during the reigns of Isaiah of Judah and Jeroboam II of Israel. Hosea 1, 1, Amos 1, 1. But Hosea tells us that his ministry also spanned the reigns of Judah's kings Jotham and Ahaz, ending in the reign of Hezekiah Hosea 1, 1. Though not mentioned, this means that he also witnessed the reigns of the last six of Israel's kings. The New Living Translation's introduction to the book of Hosea calls it a tragic love story with a happy ending. Dot. What Hosea went through serves as a powerful object lesson of what God has gone through with his covenant people. Another source states, Hosea's marriage was extraordinary in that he was called to marry an unfaithful woman. Hosea 1, 2. Gomer's exact background is not known but it could be that she had been unfaithful to a previous husband, or she might have been a prostitute. She might have been the particular kind of prostitute that was associated with some of the pagan religions that were being practiced then in Israel. Whatever Gomer's background, she was a powerful symbol of Israel's spiritual adultery against the Lord. Hosea 2. 2. The nation had departed almost entirely from worship as prescribed in the law. Instead, the people had taken up the religions of the cultures around them such as the Canaanites, the Phoenicians, and the Moabites. Just as Israel abandoned God, Gomer left her husband and returned to a life of prostitution. She seems to have ended up in the slave market, where Hosea bought her back for 15 pieces of silver and some grain. Hosea 3, 2. This was not much money, just the common price of a slave. Compare Exodus 21 32. But it was a great sacrifice of love on Hosea's part. The prophet was demonstrating the love of God for his unfaithful people, and providing a symbol of the reconciliation that would someday take place. Hosea 3, 4, 5, Word in Life Bible, Prodigal Wife Prodigal, People 19, 98 Sidebar, on Hosea 2, 2. In the meantime, Hosea 2, 1, God gave Israel another chance to repent, but if she refused, she would be dealt with harshly. Halley's Bible Handbook further explains, not only was Hosea's marriage an illustration of the thing he was preaching, but the names of his children proclaim the main messages of his life. Jezreel, Hosea 1, 4, 5, his firstborn, was named after the city of Jehu's bloody brutality. 2 Kings 10, 1, 14, the valley of Jezreel was the age-old battlefield on which the kingdom was about to collapse. By naming his child Jezreel, Hosea was saying to the king and to the nation, the hour of retribution and punishment has come. Note on Hosea 1 3. Moreover, in Hebrew Jezreel means God scatters. Seed. Here the name is used as a threat, meaning the Lord will punish Israel by scattering its people. Word in life. Note on Hosea 1 4. Lo Ruhama. Hosea 1 6. The name of the second child meant not loved. God's mercy had come to an end for Israel, though there would be a respite for Judah. V 7. Lo Ami. Hosea 1. 9. The name of the third child, meant not my people. Hosea then repeats the two names without the low prefix, Ami and Ruhama, my people and my loved one. Hosea 2, 1. Looking forward to the time when Israel would again be God's people, and in a play on the words, he predicts the day when other nations will be called the people of God. Hosea 1 10. A verse Paul quotes to support his message that the gospel will also be extended to include Gentiles. Romans 9 25. Halley's. Note on Hosea 1 3. Actually, the Gentiles must become Israelites in order to be God's people, that is, spiritual Israelites. Compare Galatians 3 26 29, Galatians 6 15 16, Romans 2 26 29, Romans 9 8, Romans 11 1, Romans 11 11 24, Ephesians 2 verses 11 to 13, Ephesians 2 verses 19 to 22. God shows us through Hosea that he still loves Israel in spite of her infidelity. Having separated Israel from her lovers, the Lord would seek to win her back by making romantic overtures and wooing her with tender words of love. Nelson Study Bible. Note Hosea 2.14. At that time, 
the Israelites are to call God Ishi, my husband, instead of Bali, my master or my lord, in order to remove all remembrance of their former devotion to Baal. Actually, ancient Israel practiced syncretism, i.e., blended religion, often confusing the identities of Baal and the Eternal, in part because both were referred to as Lord. We should note two things in this regard. One is the fact that Baalism had again reared its ugly head in Israel at the time Hosea preached, despite Jehu's earlier purge. The other is the fact that Hosea's message was primarily to Israel of the end time. Interestingly, the nations of modern Israel supposedly worship the Lord, but this Lord is not really the true Lord of the Bible, as he is usually worshipped with many of the trappings of Baalism. To put it more directly, what the world at large understands to be Christianity is actually a blended religion a mix of some of the same customs of the ancient pagans with concepts and language of the New Testament millions of people think they accept Christ as their savior, when in fact, they embrace a religion that Jesus will reject. Matthew 7 verses 21 to 23. Thankfully, after a long exile, Hosea 3, 4, the Israelites will finally be reunited with the true God in the land of promise. Verse 5, the time when all Israel returns to God will be a magnificent period of peace. Hosea 2:18. When weapons of war will be gone. Isaiah 2, 4, Micah 4, 3, and when there is rain in due season. Hosea 2:21, Leviticus 26, 4, and agricultural abundance. Hosea 2:22. Then, the people of Israel will at last know their God. Verse 23. In Hosea 1:11, the name Jezreel, again meaning God scatters, seed, is, this time, used as a promise meaning the Lord will bless Israel by giving their nation many people, just as a big harvest comes when many seeds are scattered in a field. Comma word in life. Note on Hosea 1, 4, comma and, Hosea 1, verse 1 that John Gill commentary states, from whence it appears that Hosea prophesied long, and lived to a great age, for from the last year of Jeroboam, which was the fifteenth of Isaiah, to the first of Hezekiah, must be sixty-nine years. Dot. Hosea 2. Verse 1 Since sometimes the translators leave the Hebrew untranslated, such as Lo Ruhama, Hosea 1, 6, and Lo Ami, Hosea 1, 8, and sometimes they translate the Hebrew into English, we can perhaps miss the word play that God has inspired. For example, here in verse 1, the NKJV simply says, Say to your brethren, my people, and to your sisters, mercy is shown, but what likely isn't apparent to everyone on the surface, this is the Hebrew word Zami my people, and Ruhama, mercy is shown, this time stripped of the low particle that adds the not or no additional meaning, we will continue to see these themes of my people and God's mercy, Hosea 3, verse 1 the John Gill commentary states, and love flagons of wine, or tubs of grapes, or of wine made of them, or lumps of raisins, cakes or junkets made of them and other things, as the Septuagint, and may respect either the drunkenness and intemperance of the ten tribes, see Isa 28, 1, they loved, as kimchi says, the delights of the world, and not the law and commandments of God, or the feasts that were made in the temples of their idols they loved good eating and drinking, and that made them like idolatry the better for the sake of those things, see XO 32, 6, for the heathens used to eat and drink to excess at their sacrifices, hence Diogenes the philosopher was very angry with those who sacrificed to the gods for their health, yet in their sacrifices feasted to the prejudice of their health, 